We have shit to do here. And we should probably see if there's anything else we want to do on this island. Oh yeah, there is one thing. Sorry, someone keeps bothering me every time. Uh, oh, you might want this one actually for Beast. There's a nice book here. Um, Alexander's Cloak requires Intel Hente 12. Well, you're going to like that. Um, so, the, th the thing is, um, there's apparently a skeleton that you need to talk to as Effin. That's a that's a, a traitor and it does something for your quest line, or something. Okay, in the second town. And in the first town, it's like a vendor. Someone's been telling me to tell you to talk to it like since like the beginning. A shrewd belt, twelve physical armor. Oh, that's kind of nice. The one has a bunch of shit on it, by the way. <laughs> All right, I'll have a look in a minute. Combat dagger. I'll give it to you. Red Prince. Who, who's who's our rune carrier right now? We're just kind of holding on to them, but like, uh, I have some on me, I think. I have all of them. Alright. By the way, here's the uh, chest you ordered. <laughs> Alright, I'll just give it to Red Prince the runes. Jeez. Well, the Jeez. staff is... I guess I'll just give it to you. I need to put ring. Fuck, I didn't identify it. Uh, Warrior's Helm, strength 12. Plus 1 to strength, plus 1 to summoning. Ooh! I like summoning. Yeah, but strength helm. I mean, I might have beast. the strength for it. <laughs> I have 11. <laughs> yeah, I gave it to Beast. Yeah, we already know what that is. Yeah, that's probably not worth it. Is it good for beast though? The chest, ah! the chest doesn't have anything in it. Oh, good. Great. Oh, no, no, wait, wait. There was another chest that she had. The fuck? How many chests did she have? have? I don't know. Why what? is she carrying a chest? I don't know. When, when did you give it to her? I don't know. Do you, hey, do you like geomancy? There's a really nice ring here, actually, for you. Uh, well, uh, Beast uses Geomancy, so... Yeah, well, I'll give you a ring. Finesse, Warfare, and Summoning. That's a Finesse Helm, oh. so you don't want that. That is nice. Yep. Uh, do, do any of you want Withermore's girdle? I'll just get, I'll just pass it to you. It's a, kind of a piece of shit at this point, but you know. Oh, Alexander's cloak? What the fuck? Yeah, that one's really good. Intelligence, but I'd lose my summoning. But I think I can get a point of summoning. Yeah. I... No. Yes, I do get a point of summoning. Supernova. I'll just give that to you because I don't want that. So now base ten, and I can take this off and put Actually, on this cloak. What does Supernova do? Actually, no, I don't do fire at all, so fuck it. We're not doing fire magic on this character. And it scales off intelligence, so... This is that. Intelligente. Oh, wait, this is a better chest space. Oh, I, man. I figured I had some better rings here and shit. Alright, now let me look at this fucking chest. We are so, like, we, we have to do so much, like, fucking shit here. Okay, there's a lot of nice things in here. Uh, hydro fucking whatever. Okay, I'll give that to you. The hydro skill. Alright, the gloves here are finesse 12. Critical, 2% critical chance. Yeah, I'll take that. For myself. Equip. Oh, these, these gloves also give, uh, uh, they also have a slot in them, I didn't realize. That's interesting. Power infusion, you already have that, but I'll give it to you anyways. I'm selling, yeah. Uh, the gloves I'm about to give you, you can just sell. I don't, I don't, I don't want them. Oh, uh, this is a one-handed axe. So that's for uh, Beast. Alright. And there's still more people here to loot. We're not fucking done. Yep. Oh, wait, that guy's done. Uh, and then there's the, then there's the Geist at the top here. Unidentified ring and shadow essence. I'll give that. Oh, let me go ahead and make that knock out arrow. Make that arrow for you. Plus one to pyrokinetic, five percent uh, fire resistance. 
Alright, so do you want the pyrokinetic ring? Because I kind of... It gives a lot of magic resistance. Man, sure, if you want to go ahead and take it. No, no, you can have it. Like, I, I, don't, I don't really care that much. I, I only got like one or two points in pyrokinetic. Hey, we can do another talent now. Fucking hell. Big okay, it's like it's me. They go knock down Arif Sabiel. Duck, duck, goose lets you evade attacks of opportunity. Huh. Sounds good. Shooting arrows will inflict bonus elemental damage depending upon the surface your target is standing in. No. That sounds bad. Well, I mean, if I do blood rain on everything and then she does more damage based upon that, I guess, because they're standing in blood, but still. I, I still wouldn't really want... Uh, like, it's it's an option. No glass cannon. Glass cannon sucks balls. Gorilla, no, because I don't ever sneak. Leeches you when standing in blood. Uh, heals you when standing in blood. No. Living armor. Living armor adds 35% of all healing you receive by skills or consumables to your magic armor. No. Lone Wolf, no. Meme Tonic, no. Morning Person, no. Opportunist, no. Meme Tonic. Yeah, exactly. She doesn't need Pet Pal. Savage Sortilage gives all magical skills a critical chance equal to your critical chance score, no. Because I like they just take my physical damage, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, Slingshot adds an extra 5 meter range for grenade throws, no. Stench, Stench might be good for Sibyl. But... Not that good. Torture increases duration of damage stat uh, damage status is caused by your skills and surfaces by one turn. No. Unstable makes you explode in a blood cloud when you die. No. Walk it off. Reduce all durations by one turn. Even positive ones. No. Uh, water rush increases your recovery and maximum AP points by one when your health is below 50%. Okay. Most of these are just not very good for me. I guess I'll do the one where, depending upon what they're standing in, I do more damage or whatever. She doesn't really benefit from all of these. Um, I mean, the best one I can think of is, like, healing a bit of her magical armor when she gets healed. It's, it's like, that's not that bad, but still, it's not that great. Like, she's... I want her to do as much damage as humanly possible, so... I could maybe get Far Out Man, but... Yeah, Far Out Man uh, would be good for you, I think, but... Yeah, no, Far Out Man is fine for you. I was thinking like that old mnemonic, but I don't think I need that. Alright, we're doing Elemental Ranger. Cause I, I, there's really nothing better here, honestly. Yeah, I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna grab Far Out Man, because it will... I do a lot of skills like that. Alright. Alright. There we go. More into ranged. And I think I was doing more wits. I think we have enough finesse. For now. Okay. And so for my guy... So I already got a bunch of points into... Yeah, like, I, I, these are not a problem anymore. I have a lot of skills here, but, like, a lot of them I don't use, so... Like whatever. Alright, so for this guy, I guess just more strength or more constitu... More strength, I think, because we just need damage. What about one beast? Uh, this is a big one. So what do I get on my Yoshi? Gorilla, no. Yeah, I think we're gonna go with, uh, we're gonna go with Leech on this guy. Because, I mean, heals you while standing of blood, might as well. And then I think two-handed damage would be good, because we're, la we're severely lacking in that. Alright, that's it for that. So, I mean, if you want any of your oil barrels, this is also the time to go get those. Oh, where, where's the... Yeah, okay, we got the archer action, never mind. Alright, let's let's uh, let's have a look at our quest log, and we'll see what we have here. Actually, just looking at the map, we've been everywhere, I think. I mean, but there's still a couple things, like the escape. We are ready to leave, you should talk to her, the rare prey. It says, Alexander, son of... Larkin the Divine was also a Godwoken. He was tutored by Dallas's associate, Verdman. Hopefully it wasn't a mistake to kill him. 
Oh, I mean, it doesn't tell me anything else here. A lot of these are closed, by the way. Call to arms. The past is clear. We should be able to move on with Lady Vengeance now. Is that Lady Vengeance, by the way? That's Melody. Oh, I mean, uh, probably the boat, maybe. That might have been the boat that the Majesties have. Okay. Champion of the Gods of the Red Prince. In the Hall of Echoes, I met my god. Yeah, that's fine. We don't have anything. The pr Imprisoned Elf. I mean, I don't think there's anything. Uh, there's the Burning Pigs. We, we went a once cursed pig. They, uh, it wanted to be restored to uh, its original form, one of a human. I mean, we could see what the deal with that is. What do you mean, try emerged from Tyrant's Helm and tried to kill us? Uh, artifacts of the, the Tyrant. We, I, I don't think we found all of them, but uh, they, they're apparently pretty mediocre. So, I'm told. Comments spoiling everything. <laughs> Well, why'd you read them then, idiot? I don't, it's just because I don't really care about spoilers. I don't give a fuck. The Cursed Ring. The Red Prince. Yeah, I don't think I really give a fuck about that. <laughs> yeah, the ring you put on. Yeah. I didn't do anything, though. I was like, I was like, whatever. I don't care. The Eternal Worshipper. We found the jar of Gred Tenda. We must be very careful as to what we do with it. I mean, what do we do with it? Uh, we, one of us has that, actually, still. Yeah, it's the... It's the jar of the nice lady in the camp. Oh. Maybe we should ask her about that. Yeah, let's go there. Like, what's some words that can buy some skill books, right? Yeah, some do, you have, do you have the jar? Um... Don't think so. I don't want beast, at least. Let me check. So, so it, says, it says here that the murderous geist is dead. And that's it. There's no nothing else because it's right here. It's this thing. We actually have a quest related to it, which is odd. Uh, let, let's go. By the way, get F in the tuck to the the skeleton. I don't know where he is though, but it's not Fane. It's someone else. Oh, it. Oh, it's the guy. Remember that's at the drawbridge. You never talked to him. I did. It's that at guy. Oh, that guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One second. We got a waypoint for that. Yeah, yeah that's, one? that's who it is. It's uh, fuck. bridge, bridge. Yeah, that's the guy, that's the guy the guy I was referring to. Because ever since then, the, someone's been timing the comments like, "You need to talk to that guy. Ethan needs to talk to him." And I'm like, uh, "I'm just like chilling." So hopefully, hopefully he forgives me. Hooded man excludes uh excludes the aura of unrestrained menace. His uh, he as he raises his head, his hood falls back. Revealing the gleam of bone visage of the undead. Ah, Ethan Ben Mest, I presume. I am a friend. You can call me Zalisgar. Roost sent me to give you some aid in your little errand. You'll find it easier to corner Alexander out here. And this delicious little morsel called Shadow's Eye should help you send him to his rightful place beside his father in the Hall of Echoes. The undead's bony claw pulls an elaborate crossbow from seeming thin air. It's cold as the grave to the touch, and enveloped in misty shade. He proffers it to you, along with a single rank-smelling arrow. Ah, that should help. Now, run along with your new toys. I've my own errands to run, you know. Ask, uh, ask Zalaskar who he is and why he's helping you. You should know better than to ask such questions. That we both work for Roost is all you need to know about me. Nought else is pertinent. Ask if he has any... Oh, actually, yeah, it's probably just trading, right? Ask if he has any trades like a trade. Indeed I have. I only stock the best baubles, the choicest curios. Take a look. Precious wares, are they not? Yep, yeah, trading. See, he has this thing that turns potions to poison potions. Alright, so... Apparently, um... Huh. So, he's supposed to ask you to kill Bishop Alexander, by the way. Which we've already done. Yeah, I'm not sure what... Uh, I think we, like, did something r bad with this. I don't know. Maybe maybe talk to him again after this. Sure. Yeah. I'm you should sure make we meet again, Ben Mest. You should make a habit of uh, maybe talking to people, even though I pass by them, because I don't know who has special dialogue. You know, yeah, try and talk to him again. 
Okay. And uh, she get take your leave. So there's a, like I'm just I'm just reading the the there's a there's a wiki page on this guys. That's what I'm looking at right now because I'm curious about it now. Um, so it says here. Um, uh, it says here that uh, report to magistrate. Uh, so, what, what's your what's your thing, quest line saying for you? It basically says re uh, read the mysterious letter in Afon's inventory after recruiting him. Speak to magistrate Boris. I'm pretty sure he's dead. Find Zelskiskar, whatever that guy is. Kill Bishop Alexander and report to Zelskiskar. That's what it says. And it generally says here he's he says he's supposed to ask you to kill him. After that, you can report to him using the mirror he gave you alone. Um, and when it says alone, it means your party members have to be away, or else he won't talk to you or something. Well, I don't have a mirror. Yeah, he, well, he was supposed to give it to you. I mean, he gave me the crossbow, which I then gave to you. Okay, well, that's, that's totally awesome. <laughs> I got a crossbow. Uh, I mean, I guess it's kind of good. So I can't really complain. Oh, it gives me Carmelian cloak, nice. I can I can get cloak and cloak engaged. I'm gonna try like moving everyone away and then just having e fun. All right, yeah, I'm, just, I'm just gonna I'll, I'll go walk over. I'll, I'll maybe just go to town or something. That's I mean that's the best thing I can think of is putting them out of range. Just tell me if it changes at all. I, I I'm not sure because we kind of we kind of didn't do it at the time that like that we could have kind of thing. Broken source collar. Amidst a crowd of beasts for a while, scraps of metal. The woman is manipulating yeah, I'm, I'm a way away. fitted with five long metal skewers. She it's just needs supplies. Why does she have a bunch of shit here? And what you after? So. Maniac. Yeah, my journal says after a manic showdown, I finally managed to kill Alexander mm -hmm. and escape with my life somewhat intact. Okay. My contract is complete, but I didn't get to ask Alexander the question that's been on my mind for years. Because you didn't talk to him. I guess so. <laughs> yeah, I think you got to make a habit of talking to the the characters, and it's just because if I had known that that you had a like uh, a special thing, I would have made you open up that thing. That's a bad goal, though. I'm a summoner. I die. <laughs> I mean, you just run out. I just ran out of there. I mean, it would have been neat for a story kind of a thing, because I don't know your story, because you, I've been the one talking to these characters. So, well, from what I can divulge, he is a mercenary of sorts. He's been contract contract killer kind of guy right now. Hmm. Well, I I think I'm done with this place then. So we we uh, we probably should have talked to him before. I don't I like I don't know what your quest line is, or can I actually see it or no? Uh, we learned that a sorcerer named Master Verman has been asking for a, a tutor for Bishop Alexander, helping him master the powers he needs to become divine. Yeah, it's gonna definitely be something later. Cause it says my companions, Beast and Seabill. I don't know anything of what Beast needs to do really. So, I mean, that's that's ultimately up to you. Sure, I'll see what Beast needs to do. I mean, is there any, like, is it a matter of, is there anything else on this island that you wish to do? Kind of thing. Uh, I don't... Well, I mean, it seems like I want to get off the island right now. I don't think Beast wants to do anything. Okay, alright, well, we'll just go then. I think Beast's story is going to pertain to that queen thing. Oh, yeah, we need to go talk to... Mm -hmm. Whoops. Oh. Yeah, I'm already in Amadia's Sanctuary. Well, holy shit, I have a bunch of things with Seabill. Ask Seabill what our next move should be. Unless you love the idea of a life knee-deep in swamp water, I suggest we look for a ship. Uh... Ask Seabill the way she held a needle to your neck, which she had really killed you. In a final heartbeat. Why did you assume I wouldn't? Say you're entertained and hope she went to brutally murder you out of nowhere, yes. The only thing that springs eternal is blood from gushing wounds. And water from springs, of course, and flowers from the ground. But you catch my drift. One must cull to cultivate. There's actually a lot of things you can learn about the characters here. 
Like, there's a, like I'm catching up now on everything we've done here because I didn't actually try talking to her. They're curious about her tattoos. Names, are they not? So they are. My arms are gravestones. Many a lost soul's last rest. One day I'll know who they were, the ones on my right arm. And one day they'll all be dead, the ones on my left. <laughs> uh, what about the names on the right? They... They are the ones I was forced to kill. I don't know why. I can't recall. But I kept their names, and with their names, I will honor them. Uh... Wonder who forced her to kill. The master. A lizard, but not any lizard. A specter in the flesh, a man with no name. A darker shade in shadows. If he be a demon, as the frightened claim, I will be a demon hunter. <laughs> if he be a god, as the cowering claim, I will be a god slayer. Demon hunter. Until it is over, I will be nothing but vengeance. A day on the beach I'll be after. Say, uh, smile and say you'll join her then the day on the beach arrives. She returns your smile, though you can read the skepticism in her eyes. A lovely little promise to make. A thorny one. We'll see how bloodied you're willing to get to pluck the one rose lost in a forest of daggers. Still, I do appreciate the sentiment. All right, ask about the name on the left arm. Those are the breadcrumbs, torn and tossed aside along the long road to the master. They are <laughs> inconsequential, candles snuffed out by a brighter flame, if I do say so myself. All right, uh, ask her how she was taken in custody by the magisters. Did they catch her up God as well? <laughs> Hardly. I walked up to the quay, asked for the ship to Fort Joy, and declared myself a sorcerer. I'm here to hunt, remember? Here to play a game of tic-tac terminate with a special certain someone. Tell you still, you still want to talk more about Stinktail. My, my. I did get you all worked up, didn't I? Afraid you won't be able to sleep tonight. <laughs> I'll take her hand and ask if she'll be able to sleep tonight. She pulls her hand away, quickly and violently, as if bitten by a snake. I apologize. You shouldn't have, uh, you shouldn't have presumed. No, no, it's fine. I... I don't know why I did that. I suppose I'm a bit skittish from time to time. Skittish like a cat that's seen too much unkindness. You see, there's... Uh, there's triplets in my mind. The woman I am, the woman I must be, the woman I long to be. Like all sisters, they do tend to be at odds with one another. From time to precious time. Time she should be true to the woman she is, and the present is all that matters. If the present is all that matters, you must take me as I am. Sunshine and shadow, both. You can see what I can do. What comes as easily as a morning's yawn or a rush of blood in the presence of beauty. This, you must accept. Of course I'll accept. Thank you. How romantic a concession, to let a woman kill when she so pleases. I am fine with that. All right, ask about her scar. One of her eyebrows arcs, like a cat arching its back, ready to scratch. A touchy subject, I warn you. Uh, you're really curious, what house did she serve? None. I served but the master. The master and none but he. Thought she should, she needn't go on. She should, <laughs> you should have brought it up in the first place. Touchy subject, I warn you. I'll pull a flask from liquor from a well-hidden pocket and offer it to her worms that warms the heart. Sabeel looks at the flask with surprise, but accepts it with a nod and takes a long draught. <laughs> My word, warms the heart and everything else besides. Thank you. I needed a bit of good cheer. So, cheers. And there goes the rest of your bottle. <laughs> so something incredible <laughs> happened. You bet with your god at all <laughs> that goes, yeah, we're a, bit, <laughs> we're a bit behind. You don't say. I too had the pleasure. Of course, when I say pleasure, I mean the distinct dishonor. Laugh with the batter, did his breast smell. <laughs> like death and desperation. I'd rather not talk about it. Uh, tell her, you say you can tell she's upset. You'd like the chance to come from wherever you can. She hesitates, but you can tell she wants to speak. The thing is, Tyrson Dilius, the old father, the golden leaf, he... He wants me to become the next divine. Smile said, Zorl Stritza, the god of the lizards, wants the same of you. Her eyes fix on some unseen thing of darkness. Beware of gods bearing gifts. Divinity. And yet, 
He treated me... Like a slave? Exactly. His was an exercise in power. Brutal, like all true power is. His was a lesson, meant to discipline, not to edify. Why would I obey such a god? Uh... Let's see. <laughs> By all means, she should disobey. You'll be the next divine, not her. Uh, I don't know about that. Uh, yeah, fine, that one. Like I said, beware of gods bearing gifts. Divinity. One word and it makes you drunk already. Oh, she hates me now. Tell her, uh, okay, take your leave. Is there anything else? A moment's else? pause. I had th okay, that's it. Alright. Holy shit. I wonder what happens if she talks to me. She can't talk to me. Alright. Well, you want to go ask Beast about Beast about his shit? Because I think you have a lot of catching up with... No, you apparently you don't have a lot of catching up to do. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, you need me to read all that? Uh, uh, out of the frying pan, hey, you know what? We've heard that before. Oh, fuck it. Who cares? Just, just go do whatever. Let's try a new one. Shite's all mucked up. Seems more to the point, doesn't it? Hmm, take your surroundings. What comes next, as you suppose? Well, it just so happens that getting off islands is my speciality. I'm like the... The Aeolus of escaping islands. Get it? Aeolus. No? <clears throat> Fine, you get the gist, though. So, here's the thing. Where there's a sea, there's boats. Boom. Simple as that. We'll find one docked, or one will sail by, and... Well, as you probably figured, I'm good at stealing boats. Say so something incredible happened. You met with your god in the Hall of Echoes. Is that so? Look, I don't know where you've been and what you saw. But I believe you believe it. And I guess that's what matters, yeah? Good talk, beast. <laughs> uh, here's the thing, so... Seville said she was there. Why wasn't Beast there? Uh, maybe he's lying to you. <laughs> Just saying. I don't Just know, say, man. Just saying, maybe he's a piece of shit. Alright, let's go to the sanctuary and, uh... Where's, uh, the skeleton? Oh, there she is. Gareth's back! By all the hells! What happened? <laughs> oh, she's talking about the statue. Uh... Uh, tell you, you spoke, the statue spoke to you. You replied and then there was blood everywhere. She has never reacted with such rage. Please, I must meditate on this. So, you returned Gareth to his flock. I must say, I never thought to see him again. You have my thanks for giving them hope. But I fear for their future. They cannot escape these swamps. They do not have the strength. Is there anything we can do to help the people here? Armadia has not gifted me the grace to heal, nor the strength to fight. There is nothing more I can do. Tell you're going to get out of here, and she's going to help you. Very well. If you insist, I told the Seeker that the soul-forged weapons of Bracchus Rex remain hidden in a vault, but the Magisters recovered them before he could. Gareth failed to reach the armory in time, but there is another vault hidden beyond the Magisters' guile. If you can steal away these weapons, your friends may well stand a chance. But beware. Such items are of limited power. If they cease to function, speak to me. I will be able to help. Uh, we've already found the vault. What? You have uncovered Bracchus's hoard. Tell me, did you find anything else? The vault contains relics, soul jars. Did you see them? Do you have them? Uh, we did find them actually. What does she want with them? They are relics of great power. Please, you must give them to me. If I can make an offering of them to Armadia, it could aid your cause. Uh, give her the soldier. Give her whole, her soldier. She reaches greedily for the jar, tearing the cap off. You see a green glowing light emerge from the jar, enveloping Gratiana. By Armadia, I feel... I feel... wet. Oh, goddess, I can feel your tears upon my face. Ask what happened to her. I... I suppose you deserve to know. Before I knew Armadia's grace, I was a very different person. I was the concubine of Bracchus Rex. But more than his lover, I was his partner. 
I discovered his power to feed on the source of others, and I allowed it to... No, I made it happen. Uh, why would you do such a thing? You don't understand. No one understands. My heart held such fear, but with Bracchus, I was safe. He needed me, and I needed him. As his strength grew, so too did mine. There is nothing you cannot do when you sit on the lap of a powerful king. And I did it all. But power changes a man as he changes his nation. Bracchus grew paranoid, angry, murderous. Stand in silence. I gave him more and more, trying to win him back to me. I offered him the source of whole villages. He devoured them and demanded more. The lands outside were once green and beautiful until I came, until I turned them over to him. Now all's poison and the dead are restless. Uh, Talia, you should uh, observe at whatever crime she committed in the past. She seems to be making up for them now. Armadia is merciful in her love. I found this shrine while hunting a band of wizards. I found the goddess weeping for her children, and I wept too. <laughs> Sorry, you don't have time for this. Take your leave now. Have a rest a hand on her shoulder and say you've got you found her way. She pauses for a moment. If she had eyes, you're sure she'd be wiping them. Through Armadia, I saw my sins, and I could bear it no longer. I threw myself from the cliff at the entrance. I tried to rid the world of my evil. But Bracchus would not allow it. He brought me back from the Hall of Echoes, locked my soul away, and demanded my obedience. Even in death, he commanded me. How, how did she escape? Only when two source hunters ended his curse was I free. Since then, I have returned here and spent centuries trying to heal the pain I've caused. And now... Two source hunters? I wonder what meme lords those were. <laughs> Source hunter! <laughs> Continue. She drops the now empty soul jar to the ground, smashing it to pieces with her foot. You have my thanks, brother. Thank you for her tale and, and for trying to live a good life. She starts to speak, but chokes back a sob instead. Thank you. I don't. I can't. I've never known such kindness. Thank you for everything. May you walk forever. In Armadia's grace. Why oh, she has to trade? Enraged skill book. Chloroform. Supercharger skill. Target your summon your summon deals fifty percent more dace damage for the next turn, but then dies. But I'll not be sorry to see the back of these swamps. Sounds amazing. Alright. I don't give a fuck about most of this. So I'm just happy that the statue is still pissed off at you. Oh, dude, we get a reward. Uh, do you want this a? Uh, do, do you want boots for strength or finesse gloves, which give critical chance? Yeah, fuck that. Uh, strength boots, you said? Yeah. Uh, let me just throw on the ground what I actually can't see. No, Beast has so six no physical armor on his boots. I yeah, you can have those. Uh, that's fine. That's the I one we get then. Like even if it's your hand me downs, I just I need. No, no, no. It's 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 fine. Mine mine give bloodsucker boots. So. Oh, movement time. boots. That's pretty good. Yeah, because you need that. I think. She also has the 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 spread your wings. I don't know if you're gonna work towards it, but I think you should just try bull rush. You might find that's enough. Honestly, one point in the one magic point in polymorph. Did you get? Did you? Put yeah, that yeah, on? I did. Oh yeah, so you put you put it you put one point into polymorph. Yeah, like the, you could rush around with that. It's like it is actually enough of movement skill. If you need more than that, then as I said, you can always go for the uh, the wings. But yeah. All right, is there anything else here now? Call to arms. It has been suggested that we should find Perjuans in order to defeat the state seekers. We've already done, we've already done that. All right. Well, they have. There is the burning pigs quest. I might just look at that briefly then. Let me let me see if that, there's anything in that. 
Burning pigs. I'm not sure what else we could do for the burning pigs. Well, I'm just gonna make sure that we don't leave here and then we're sad. No, th this is the right call because we do still potentially have stuff to do here, maybe. Divine blessings. It's good to see Gather safe and sound. Alright, wait, it says here, so, meet the pig fetter on the slope between the abandoned camp and the frozen breeze. Start to fetter to go to sanctuary. Where, where is sanctuary? Where we're at. I forget what that is. Oh, okay, so we, we didn't know where sanctuary was at the time. So we didn't tell, we couldn't tell him to go there. So let me, let me go get him again. So we can actually finish this one up actually real fast. God, this is gonna be fucking long episode. Who's this? What? Who's who? You met. We talked to them? Oh, this guy? I think we. No, this guy over here. Yeah, yeah. I talked to him ages ago. Okay, let's just recognize him. Yeah, he doesn't tell me. He doesn't tell me anything. I mean, you, as I said, you should make a habit of talking to characters as well that I've already talked to, just because, who knows, it might tell you something separate. Alright. So I, I might go examine Alexander's corpse yeah. after this. Tell the pig hello, it's good to see her again. The feeling is mutual. I can't tell you how grateful I am for your kindness. Now I'm just trying to get used to life as a pig. It's not so easy. I never did well, it well. Well, we already know this, though. Yeah, we know Brock is Rex Forster. Is there any way to return you to your pig. previous form? Not sure. I have prayed to Armadia, but she offers no answer. Right, he asked me to, if there was a shrine to Armadia, and we didn't know at the time. Do you see Armadia? Tell her about the sanctuary of Armadia. Uh, yes, the pig should move to a shrine of Armadia. She might convene with her goddess there. Really? Oh, what wonderful views! If there's a shrine to Armadia there, I may return to my old self just yet. I'll head that way now. I hope to see you there. Alright, and now let me... So now she knows where it is. So let's go to sanctuary. Fuck. It has to go there. <laughs> How is she gonna make it here? She like, finds a way. The goddess's tears still stream freely. An aura of immutable dread permeates the moist, gaping air. Bow your head, close your eyes, so you can breathe a deep breath and call to her. Uh, I right. pray you will I, So where did the pig go? Do you, did you see where the pig went? <laughs> no. I jumped away instantly to go look for stuff. Oh, there he is. Oh, there. Okay, I found him. Alright. It's quite beautiful here, but I'm afraid my journey to the sanctuary might have been in vain. I've prayed to Amadia real hard, but I'm not sure it's done much good. Still, a wizard trapped in a pig's body. Suggest you get in the pool. Any, oh, <laughs> grand idea! I'll try that. What's the worst that could happen? Uh, oh, she was asking ideas. <laughs> Getting out of the pool! Uh, <laughs> get out! Get out of there! Seville, it's not safe. This one might serve you, but... Thank you, Gareth. Oh, no, dear! I can't wait to save <laughs> me! Well, um... What cruelty is this? About you <laughs> it's dead. Deliver peace. Good to see you. We were afraid. We were so afraid. Pretty dead. Fuck. Blessed well, uh, Grant these soldiers your it, it is it because they pissed off Armadia before? <laughs> What's the worst that could happen? The pig entered the cursed waters of Armadia's sanctuary and died instantly. Maybe maybe we should have like Buff the cloud. Bless the water. Yeah. I pray this. No. Here, maybe I'll load it. You want to load it up? Yeah, let's load it up again. What's the worst that can happen? <laughs> Good old Doctor Pepper. So, uh, what do I bless the cloud or what? <laughs> no. I guess I bless the cloud. Uh, we tried talking to the statue again. No, it won't talk to me anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I, I guess maybe I'll try talking to a Seville or something. Yeah, the pig's here now. All right, all right, fine. Well, I'll try talking to. Maybe you can try talking to the statue. The goddess's tears still. 
Yeah, you call you call to her. Yeah, try talking to it. Yeah, no, you can't. That you can't. I bought your head. Yeah, I just fucked that. Fucked that. Okay, let me bl let me bless the cloud. Oh. There you go. There you go. Thanks for sending me. I prayed to okay. Amadi a real. Ste step in the pool. All right. What's the worst that could happen? That's actually a really fucking cool cloud. Oh shit! No, it fucking undid it. I pray you will bless their what? So no curse may pass it. Okay, apparently it only happens for a couple turns. All right. Just to do it again. Yeah, that's yeah, fine. I'll, I'll just I'll just immediately uh, do it after I talk to it. <laughs> I mean, it's worth a try, isn't it? Oh yeah, I gotta save this pig. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Save the bacon. This may do some damage before it breaks forever. Thanks for sending me here. Right, I prayed to a man. Okay, the pool. All right. This one might serve, but not for long. Did you? Yeah, there you go. Get in there. Amadia, save me! No. This work? Maybe. I think it's just dead. Amadia, deliver peace. Okay. Yeah. Let me let me see what the thing with this is. No, I just I just looked it up. Yeah. It's because you fucked up with the statue. I know, I know. After Fe after Fetter becomes a woman, she trades great armors and weapons. Rip. <laughs> you did this. I have no regrets whatsoever. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to get some delicious. Um, uh. I'm gonna get some delicious uh, source point, and then I'm going to, I'm gonna meet you at the beach. Okay, actually, you should come too. Yeah, I should come too. Ruined castle. Like, I kind of want to do some selling, but I can do probably do that when we leave the camp. I, 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 I mean, island. actually, actually, we can do that now. So why don't, why don't we just end the episode here? Actually, that sounds uh, fine. Because this is <laughs> end the enough. episode on failure. Alright guys, so next time we're gonna, uh, like that's, like that's it. If you tell me in the comments now if there's anything else to do this, we've pretty much already gone past it, so this has been long enough. Uh, we're finally leaving Tutorial Island, so can't just go sell stuff. I'm gonna just make sure that there isn't anything we necessarily want to do now. Uh, so that's pretty much it, so, uh, take care guys. Uh, goodbye. Goodbye!